Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back. So today we're going to be doing a lip swatch video swatching new matte lipsticks as well as some new lip liners and I am super, super, super excited about this video because y'all already know I am a lip junkie. Like when it comes down to lip glosses, lipsticks, even liquid lipsticks, I am all about it. If you guys are familiar with Minted Cosmetics, they just came out with some new matte lipsticks as well as the matching lip liners. And let me just tell you guys, I was ecstatic, ecstatic when I found out that they were coming out with lip pencils. I have been wanting a matching lip pencil for the lipsticks that I already have in my collection and they finally came out with lip pencils. So they were so kind enough to send over the PR package to me. So I have all of their original lipsticks in here as well as their new lip liners and as well as their new matte lipsticks. So I'm not going to swatch any of the original lipsticks because I do have a separate video on that if you guys missed it. I did swatch every single one of these lipsticks so I will make sure to have that video down below in the description. But today we are going to be swatching their matte lipsticks as well as their new lip liners. And every single lip liner pairs with every single lipstick. So there are nine lipsticks and nine lip liners and I cannot wait to show you guys how they look on the lips. I cannot wait to show you guys the swatches and I also cannot wait to tell you guys my thoughts on these lipsticks. So make sure you guys stick to the very end because I do have a little surprise for you guys. I'm super excited. Y'all know I love a lip product and the fact that all of these colors are like women of color friendly like y'all so the way i'm going to be doing this video is i'm going to be showing you guys the swatches as well as how they look on the lips and then at the end of the video i will let you guys know my thoughts on the lip products so yes let's go all right so the first shade that we're going to swatch is called peach please and this is i think the lightest one in here so we're going to start out with the lightest and then work our way down to the darkest. So first off, let's swatch the lip pencil. And the texture of these lip pencils are very, very creamy, very smooth, and they are definitely pigmented. And I'm also gonna swatch the lipstick right beside the lip liner so you guys can see it on the hand. But there's Peach Please right there. Such a really pretty peachy nude, very, very gorgeous. And I feel like this color will also look good with a brown lip liner. But if you are into these type of like light peachy nude, like pinky type of shades, then I'm pretty sure you guys will like this color. Then we have Pretty in Pink. And this one is more of a kind of like a, um, a bubblegum pink, but it's not too pinky. It's definitely a wearable light like Barbie doll bubblegum pink, but it does have a little bit of a peach um, undertone. It's still wearable, still really pretty, and I think it looks really pretty on the lips. And I feel like this color is really cute to wear for the spring and summer, as well as the very first one that we swatched. Then we have Nude La La. This is more of a um, kind of like a pinky mauve color. Super, super pretty. Definitely a good everyday color. You guys know these type of shades are all up my alley. I just think this is a really pretty everyday color. And it's kind of like your lips, but better. It's not too dark. It's not too bright. It's just that perfect everyday color lip. Then we have Brand Nude, which is actually one of my favorite um, nudes from this collection. It's kind of light, but it actually looks really good on the lips. And I think you can definitely pair a darker brown lip liner with this if you're not into these lighter nude taupey colors. But I think it's a really, really pretty taupey nude. Definitely a good everyday lip. And like I said, if you want to pair like a dark lip liner, like a darker brown with the lipstick, um, you can definitely do that. And that's one thing that I really like about this collection is you can actually mix and match. So you have these lighter nudes, but you can mix it up with these darker nude lip liners to make that perfect lip color for yourself. This next one is called Dope Taupe, and this is also one of my favorite ones. I actually like every single one of these colors, but my favorites would have to be the ones that I'm mentioning that, that are my favorites. But this is a really pretty, kind of like a brick red slash brown color. It is so freaking gorgeous. Let me show you guys what the swatches look like side by side. Um, but yeah, this is a really pretty kind of like an everyday um, brick, kind of like a brick red slash brown color on the lips. It's not, you know, too red. It's not too pink. It's just that perfect amount of brown and gray. Then we have Brown Bear, which is a little bit darker. This is more of a darker. Um, these are so freaking creamy, you guys. Like these lip pencils are 
so creamy but this is more of a um, it's also kind of like the one that we just watched but it's a little bit more deeper it's more of a brown slash red um, nude so pretty I'll swatch the lipstick side by side but there is um, brown bear I think that's what it yeah brown bear this is also another one of my favorites in the collection super super pretty love this color and then we have foxy brown which is also one of my favorites in this collection this is a gorgeous true brown color it is so freaking pretty you guys I love how it looks on the lips I love how it looks swatched it's just that perfect terracotta brown which I absolutely love definitely a good wearable brown if you're wanting to you know wear it as an everyday shade I feel like you can definitely get away with that then we have minted number five and this is more of a mauve nude really really pretty another one of those colors that I would definitely wear as an everyday color um, Super gorgeous, super pretty. Now this shade is a little bit more darker on the lips. It's still really pretty, still a good shade to wear as an everyday color. It's not too, too dark, but it's just that perfect vampy, mauve nude. It's so gorgeous. And then last but not least, we have the darkest shade, which is called Dark Night. And it's actually what I have on my lips right now because this is the very last shade that I swatched. But this is a gorgeous, 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 dark brown I love a brown lipstick you guys if you have been watching my channel for a while you guys know I am all about a brown lip and this is a really true dark brown color it's so pretty all right so those are all nine shades swatched now let's go ahead and talk about my thoughts on the lipsticks and the lip pencils so we're gonna go ahead and start out with the lipsticks now the lipsticks are a matte lipstick so if you're into matte lipsticks I'm pretty sure you will like these if you don't like a matte lipstick you may not like these and what I notice about these matte lipsticks is they are a true matte lipstick and I say that because when you first apply it on the lips you can already see that it's a matte lipstick some lipsticks that claim to be matte when you apply it on the lips they kind of have that slight sheen to them but these are true matte lipsticks they're super comfortable super pigmented as you guys saw when I was doing the swatches on the lips very comfortable on the lips so I'm very impressed with these if I had to compare these to a you know a well-known lipstick I would definitely compare them to the matte cosmetics lipstick but they're actually a little bit more matte than the matte cosmetics even the packaging is very similar to MAC lipsticks but the only differences that I could tell with these compared to a MAC lipstick is these actually feel a little bit more light on the lips I don't know if that makes sense but these it's like I don't have anything on my lips. They're super, super lightweight, super comfortable, and I literally feel like I have nothing on my lips. So, um, yeah, I just kind of wanted to compare these to, um, you know, a lipstick that most of you have probably already tried out. But, yeah, and let's talk about the lip liners, you guys. First off, these do twist up, but I do want to show you guys how much product comes in this. But this does come with a lot of product, as you guys can see. I twisted it all the way up for you guys but this does come with a lot of product and these are also matte um, just like the uh, the matte lipsticks these are also you know gonna go on your lips matte and also they go on super super easy on the lips you guys saw when I was applying it on the lips they just literally glided on the lips they're so so easy to apply and I love the fact that they twist up honestly I don't really care for lip liners that I have to you know continuously sharpen because for one I always lose my pencil sharpeners so I'm really glad that they made these to where you can just twist them up and they're super easy to apply they're not drying that's one thing that I also like about these is sometimes when you apply a matte like a, um, a matte lip liner it kind of tugs the lips you guys know the ones from MAC cosmetics like the lip pencils they kind of tug the lip I don't know if I'm the only one that feels that way but some lip liners they are hard to apply they kind of tug the lips and they're not you know super smooth as you know when you apply them on the lips but these are so freaking creamy they glide on creamy and they still have that matte finish which is what I like and as far as the color like the actual colors these are perfect 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 for anybody's skin tone and I love that about this brand so if you are my skin tone or a little bit darker and you have been you know on the hunt for a perfect nude lip they got them they have a ton of lipsticks 
obviously they have the liners and they also have glosses so if you are into glosses they have nude glosses on their website as well as an eyeshadow palette I did do a full video on their palette if you guys missed that video I'm gonna also have that one linked down below and I think I did a video on their glosses I think I can't remember if I can find that video if I did it I will have it linked down below as well so yes I think that is all that I have to share about these new lipsticks and lip liners they did just launch today so if you guys are interested in checking them out I will have a link down below for you guys also if you stuck to the very end of this video I have a surprise for you so I have teamed up with Minted Cosmetics to do a giveaway so one of you will win this whole entire box of lipsticks and lip liners now not this one because obviously you guys saw that I use this one but one of you lucky winners will win an entire PR box of all of their original lipsticks which has the um, the cream kind of like a cream um, satin finish which again, I will have the video of me swatching all of their original lipsticks down below in the description. You'll also get all of their new lip liners as well as their new matte lipsticks. So if you guys are interested in entering the giveaway, I will have the rules down below in the description. So make sure you check that out. But yes, I think that is all that I have for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you guys have already tried out anything from Minted Cosmetics, let me know what you tried out. I wanna know your thoughts. You guys know I love to know your thoughts on anything that I share on my channel. So let's go ahead and chit chat down below in the comments and don't forget to check out the description down below I will have all of the giveaway deets down there as well as all of the videos that I've mentioned in today's video so I think that is everything that I have for today I hope you guys enjoyed it if you did make sure you thumbs it up make sure you are subscribed if you're not subscribed already and I'll see you guys in my next one bye